How are we doing today, guys? Once again, welcome back to Viper 9 Videos. Thank you for joining me. And I also still want to apologize about my voice. I don't know what the heck's going on, but the show must go on. I've got to open more toys, and I'm super excited to add things to my collection. This one here today, I have the Star Wars 30th Anniversary Stormtrooper Commander from The Force Unleashed. Still haven't played the video game, but I'm trying to get close to a good collection of all these figures. Uh, I'm very close, but so I'm very excited to add the Stormtrooper Commander to my collection. As you can see there, species cloned humans, so this is still claiming that they're clones at that time. Um, I don't think that's officially canon anymore, but I'm not entirely sure. Uh, overall, I'm, let's just get this guy open here, shall we? Was that a little bit of a, nope. Okay, so as always, if you're enjoying my content, if you're enjoying my videos, I have more things coming down the pipeline. If you'd like to go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, you know, on any videos that you happen to appreciate, it would be much appreciated as well. This one here has the really weird separate deal for the stand you know what i'll just go ahead and show you guys so it does have the figure stand there for the stormtrooper commando it says on it expanded universe stormtrooper commander i'm not going to waste any more time trying to get that out of there i will just get it out later has a little force unleashed Advertisement. Oh, randomly inserted codes. Ooh. So it does look like he is held in by some of these pesky little rubber bands. Let's go ahead and get them cut, shall we? Let's see if we can't get them out of the box. So unfortunately, it does look like he is a little miscolored. I don't know if you could tell that from the video. See if we can't get some focus in there. No, I guess on the screen, he looks pretty all right. But he does have a little bit of yellowing going on in his chest area there. But that's just due to the age. Let's get this, this rubber band out of his hand. I'm holding his blaster because I do not like them. There we go. Rubber band gone. Packaging gone. Let's go ahead and take a look at this character. So he does have pretty good articulation in the upper arms, it does feel. The helmet is sloppy on his head. The helmet does come off. He does have just the double or the single ball-jointed neck. Nice little. I think that is the same clone trooper head that they were using during the 30th anniversary. I wonder if this guy would be any remnant to the 501st Troopers where he's wearing the classic blue. But does have good shoulder articulation. No, with the way they did that joint there, no hindrance whatsoever on that. Nice little elbow. Just a hand swivel. No rocker ankles there or a rocker wrist there or anything like that. I'm really digging the paint deco on this guy. He does have the, the upper chest swivel. Pretty decent upper chest swivel or mid chest swivel there. As far as the upper legs, he does just have a T crotch. Can get into a pretty good seated position, but no, no real power posing or anything like that. Single joint knees, but they still have some pretty decent range of articulation. Can do a nice little, nice little running stance there, I guess. And then just regular uh, swivel or pivot ankles no rockers or anything like that overall for a 30th anniversary figure i do really really like this one um he's gonna once again look good up there with my stormtroopers put him up there next to like the joker squad and a couple of the other the other stormtroopers maybe behind juno eclipse but there you have it there is the 30th anniversary force unleashed stormtrooper commander and as always, guys, thank you for watching.